Hey guys, it's a 10 man. Why don't you just hold on here and walk in with me? I'm doing a. Whoa. Lucky on that. Lots of fresh vines right here. Okay. <clears throat> a human's gone and done that. I watched the lady put the thing up there. I don't know why she did that. It's kind of weird. But, anyways, um. I think that's maybe been shifted too because I don't think, I don't think, I don't think very often. But look at what's happening. Can blame it on water. People will. But those were in better alignment. But this has been changing. Um, I've talked with maintenance here and helped make him aware of there's a big problem going on here. Look at how much that's dropped actually. Wow. That could be maybe over a foot, or close to a foot, I should say. Anyways, it's percol percolating again. So I thought, I'm going to start down here. And not only is it percolating, they've been doing more digging. So what I'm trying to figure out is, if they are digging, are they just digging and throwing the scoops somewhere? Or are they actually transporting it out of here? So this is quite murky, stirred up stuff. And is that natural or is that because every night it gets stirred up and it doesn't settle, even in this spot here? And that's the flow. Just take whatever into consideration you want. I'm seeing no spillage of any sorts going all along in here. So I'm just going to stay at this point here. So no spillage, no spillage of it, say, on top of that wall. I wonder if those rocks are different. Is that wall leaning more? I think it could be worse. But that's just kind of a think. But anyways, for sure, that hole over there, that was the original small, the smaller spouting one, I believe. You can still see on the right side there how it's got the scooping like marks in it. Stopped percolating. I don't know. I think it probably is. I think just from this view, we might not be able to tell in both of those two spots. Yes, it is. There we go. So that's percolating still. See it come up now. So that's very, uh, that's weird. Have they gone and somehow from the holding tank sprung a leak somewhere and it's coming up through there? Or is that from the drainage damage they've done up here and it's coming and somehow percolating through there. You know, something like that is probably not a live water line is my guess. It's just got to be gravity pushed coming up there. Guessing. Anyway, so once again we see some really good markage, but I think I have to do, I do have to jump down because I think I want a much closer look on that because look at how close it is to shore. There's a little speculation of that stick right there. I never noticed that until the other day I was up on the wall. I didn't get any... I might have got still photos of it. Yes, I did. But yesterday I didn't do any pictures or anything. But... Oh, I mean uh, video. But look at that. Look at those spaces there now. So I... This is probably butted up against that concrete wall somewhat or something. So we're going to try to get a view on that too. So hold on for a minute, please. Okay guys, all I've done is come down off of this retaining wall and then right away I see, okay, nice strategically placed kind of collapsible little stuff. You guys see what's set up there. You can kind of tell I would imagine. If you can't, that's kind of a full setup of just things set in certain ways. So this whole side is in a way. So in other words, are they just going to in part, do they just relate with the mess we left? Or can they smell that I've been down here? You know, well, 